I am here to share everything with you guys like what have been going on for the past six seven months and where I have been <laughs> Hey guys, my name is Joy Etua and welcome to my channel. If you're new on here, you're welcome. And I'm a content creator based in Lagos, Nigeria, and I do content relating to hair, beauty, lifestyle, DIYs, and all this good stuff, okay? And if you're not new yet, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Like, thank you so much for not unsubscribing. <laughs> guys, this is me coming back after six what am i saying is this six months this is me coming back after seven months guys i just had to take a break of creating content take a break of <laughs> take a break of social media take a break of youtube in a whole because guys your girl broke down like i broke down so guys if you want to know where i have been all this while please subscribe if you haven't please 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 thank you <laughs> grab your drink grab your popcorn grab your biscuits because this is going to be a very long video okay and let's get into this <laughs> so guys i would still consider myself a new youtuber even though i started sometime last year <laughs> I started my YouTube channel May last year during the old lockdown. I have a full-time job by the way. YouTube is not the only thing I do. I was doing the old work from home thing and I had spare time and I was like, okay, you know what? This is the best time to start my YouTube channel now. <laughs> People had a lot of time, like we all had time and we were all spending it on the internet because we were all at home <laughs> guys <laughs> i didn't know what i was putting myself into like i didn't know how difficult it was to create content like if you're a youtuber out there if you're a content creator out there you deserve an accolade like i am giving you some accolades what is this what you guys do like I was able to only put out 10 contents before I broke down. Yes, guys, I broke down. I was like, what? I'm not doing this. I can't do this. <laughs> I can't do this. I can't do this. No, 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 no. I'm not doing this anymore. Like, is this what you guys go through? The filming, editing, and if you're in Nigeria, Nigeria, my beloved country being a content creator in nigeria you need to put twice the effort because electricity is not stable internet expensive so ah guys honestly eh? let me just <gasps> oh my god i was talking about lights and they just brought the lights <laughs> So guys doing the old work from home thing i wasn't really at home like i was lodged the old work from home thing wasn't really possible so companies had to like invest more some companies by the way i'm not saying all some companies that could afford it had to lodge their employees in like hotels or apartments that had 24 hours electricity and internet yes so i was lodged i had like access to like 24 hours electricity free internet something that is like practically normal thing to have in other countries but in nigeria we don't have it hmm? the lockdown wasn't really that serious in nigeria so when the lockdown was like lifted employers called their employees back to work <laughs> i was able to put out 10 videos before i went back to the office and i thought it was going to be like very easy for me to like bounce back come back on youtube create content but guys it was not easy like i work in lagos and if you know lagos or if you live in lagos you would know that lagos on a normal day is stressful just the traffic alone waking up in the morning going to work facing lagos traffic 
whenever I get home, the next thing in my head is just to like sleep. Like, because the whole traffic, the whole hustle and bustle and noise and shouting and <laughs> guys, <laughs> Lagos. Lagos is sweet though. Lagos is sweet, but Lagos can be exhausting. Like Lagos is exhausting. Everything was just so discouraging for me. Like when I got home, I was back to the norm. Unstable electricity, expensive internet. For you to have unlimited internet in this country is so expensive. That was when I just decided to just take a break. I was like, you know what? I really can't figure it now, but I'm going to take a break. I had to just plan with strategize because that was something I wasn't doing at the beginning guys I wasn't planning I didn't even have like a schedule honestly guys now that I'm back I can say it's possible for me to combine my full-time job and YouTube because during that time I wasn't filming like I just took time to like plan out myself it was so ah oh, Jesus Christ <laughs> guys if you're hearing some background noises i'm so sorry like i stay really close to the road this is lagos lagos is not a quiet city lagos is a very very noisy city okay <laughs> lagos is a very very noisy city and i stay close to the road so apologies if you're hearing any background noise thank you guys when i was off i had to watch like videos on how to be consistent I had to come up with some tips that I feel would help me. Guys, if you have a YouTube channel and you also have like a full-time job, planning is something you really want to do. You don't just film on the go. During the lockdown, I was literally filming on the go. I will film on Monday, edit on Tuesday, put out the video on Wednesday. If you have a full-time job, you can't do that, obviously, because you don't have time if you're like me i would just tell you to plan if you have to take a break to do this it's fine take a break like youtube is not going anywhere instagram is not going anywhere social media is not going anywhere like imagine i was off for like six months and i'm back they didn't go anywhere okay so instead of you being like inconsistent feeling overwhelmed being mentally discouraged i would just advise you to take a break take a break and figure yourself out okay grab your journal grab your notes grab your whatever even if it's a note on your phone start putting down ideas so you don't run out of ideas like now honestly i've been piling and piling and piling the ideas i have now like i'm not even exaggerating they are over 50. so you don't forget and you don't run out of ideas okay and you also need to be giving us back to back we don't want you forgetting ideas okay thank you so guys the next tip on my list is for you to film in advance guys life can happen you might not be able to film when scheduled it's possible so i would advise you give yourself like a very very long heads up if you want to be consistent just have content ready you understand like you don't want to film today edit tomorrow upload next tomorrow please don't be like me don't be like me and honestly guys doing that would stress you creating content and uploading content in real time would stress you so i would say give yourself heads up so even when you're not able to film in a particular week you will have a content to upload that week okay guys so another tip i would say this one is not really like a youtube trick but <laughs> don't compare yourself to anyone i know this is not like a youtube trick but don't compare yourself to anyone guys i would always compare myself with all these already big youtubers and something just spoke to my head like i really don't know where that voice came from but i know it was the voice of god honestly thank you holy spirit i remember it was just a month of me doing youtube and this voice told me joy stop comparing your one month of hard work to people's 10 years of hard work guys i was comparing myself with people that have been doing it for years honestly guys what i do now whenever i see someone i really admire or someone that inspire me guys i always scroll down to their first video to see how they started and guys since i've been doing that that was when i knew that hard work pays hard work and time 
will pay guys allow yourself grow allow yourself make mistakes allow yourself learn from your mistakes okay so instead of you going to their channel and comparing yourself to them please scroll down to their first video to see how they started obviously it wasn't rosy for them too their video quality was so bad their audio was so bad <laughs> they made so many mistakes so guys please that alone should encourage you okay i feel this video is getting too long but honestly it's been long since i came here guys and i also want to show like some words of encouragement to people out there who might be going through the same thing i went through having a full-time job and also having a youtube channel like guys they are too full-time jobs and obviously your full-time job is what is paying your bills so you can't say you want to quit your job for youtube like youtube is not yet paying my bills so i can't quit my job for youtube <laughs> as i said earlier you need to have a plan that is convenient for you you also need to have like a list of youtube ideas and lastly you need to film in advance like those three things i think these three things are going to help me and also help you be more consistent okay <laughs> so guys if you've stayed this far thank you so much for watching please click on the like button below and subscribe if you haven't please please it helps my channel so much and it also motivates me okay it also motivates me thank you so much for watching this video so far and i'll see you in my next one bye